Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today I want to talk about the humerus bone in our trail arm, in our back swings. When we go into our back swing, if I demonstrate it just from a, a stood up position here, pretending a ball's on a high tee peg, and I'm just going to swing with my trail hand and arm, to me this feels quite comfortable to come back. But if I look at the angle here from the shoulder to my elbow, it's quite different to the angle of my shoulders. And ideally that humerus bone should almost be a continuation of the line of my shoulders. So it should be more in this line as I swing back. So for instance here, that would be a much better position than this one where it's very very tucked close to my body. Now for me and maybe for you as well that feels better it feels like I've really wound up the arm but unfortunately this is now in a very very awkward position to come back out if the ball was on a high tee peg there to come back out. It's almost, I'm just going to push my trail arm straight. So we get this flipping action, early extension. If I do a backswing here, just take my lead arm off and then inspect. Let's stand up and have a look. Well, you can see this angle is going down here and yet my shoulder line is fairly level to the ground because I've stood up. So that isn't correct, it should be here. So we've got freedom. If you look at Fred Couples, John Daly, Jack Nicholas, Scotty Scheffler, there's a whole host of those players that get into pretty much that position that I'm talking about. So when we swing back, Yes, we can do our dead wrist. We can do our early set of our wrists. I don't really mind what your preferred way of sort of swinging up is, but once you've made a, at least a, a reasonable setup to the ball here, we're trying to create, that's a much better position. Now I know for a fact that over, many years of hitting balls. I sometimes don't check that and I can't see where that is. I'm just going on feel. So this is something that you need to practice to get in the correct type of muscle memory. Now if I do a, a little a one that I think is right, that's got to be right and then don't cheat. Let's stand up, have a look. It's miles off, but that actually felt quite, quite good. And yes, I, I could hit the ball from that position, but it just feels like there's something hindering the smoothness back to the ball. So it's making it more difficult for me to hit it well consistently. And consistency is obviously something we all want. That would be top of the list. So let's try and do this a little bit better now. Really feel like I've got that arm. Stand up. That's quite good. I'd be fairly pleased with that. We haven't got to get a spirit level out or anything to check that. As long as it's pretty much coming out from the shoulder line. That's the position it should be in. Now, yes, it might be a little bit tucked in. Jack Nicholas was a little bit higher. Fred Couples, John Daly, and obviously they're good players. So try to feel, well, don't try to feel it. Do it, stop and check it just like I did. Because it's so easy, even on a, maybe a, three quarter swing yeah that feels good but if I stand up look where that is it's going down in almost in the, the angle of my spine it's not across the shoulders which is where this humerus bone should be 
check this out, try it, go away and work on it. Don't just swing back, hit the ball. Do five or 10, 20, 50 practice back swings. Lead arm down, stand up. Awful, awful. Yeah, I could still hit it from there. In fact, I'll do one. I'll do it wrong and let's see if I can get away with it. Ooh, it's a bit toppy. Bit of practice, maybe I can start playing quite well with that. But very, very tight in. Very awkward to get back to the ball. So let's see if I can, I'll do one little check. That looks better. Let's see if I can do that with the ball. Right, let's try and do one nice and steady. Get that humerus bone right up there. Little bit to the right. Didn't quite catch it to be fair, but it felt freer. Gone a little bit further, not my best shot. So again, just to finish, check. Yeah, that feels good. It's okay, but it's not in its natural position, which would be here, an extension of your shoulder line. Go and try it. Leave me a comment, let me know. Subscribe to my channel, help me grow my channel. That'd be really appreciated. And until next time, thanks very much for watching.